Hey, what's up, guys? I have got another Arrow video unboxing here for you. It's been a while since I got something from Arrow. It's been actually shit. The last thing I got from Arrow was probably the Hellraiser set. And that wasn't even brand new. That was just something that I finally got. But uh, this is a brand new release today. Is um, what's the day? The twenty twenty fourth? Yes, the twenty fourth of April. Um, and uh, this was released today. Um. This is a movie I've seen before. I've, I've seen The Killer Clowns from Outer Space. I just have never owned it. And I've actually almost bought that cheapo Fox. Is it Fox? I think it's Fox. Or MGM, I guess. Um, one that's like five bucks at Best Buy or Walmart or wherever. I've, I've almost bought it a couple times, but I just figured I'd wait. I knew there was an error release, and I, I thought that maybe, possibly, they would re-release it. And I'm thankful that they did, because it just, it's, a, it's a stupid fucking movie. But uh, it's pretty interesting in that it's it's so bad it's good situation. Like uh, the, the 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 costumes are funny, the deaths are the gores, fucking honestly. Just thinking about the cotton candy little pods or whatever makes me freak out. Anyway, I'm rambling. Of course, this is the um uh I, well, actually was it was it released in America before? I know it was released in the UK. I don't know, maybe it wasn't released in the US. Um, but obviously it is now. So anyway. Um, as you can see, it's covered. The slip cover is covered. Everything's covered. So I'm gonna take my um, Lizacto thing here and take this off. Not an Exacto knife, actually. I misspoke. It's a, uh, a box cutter. I'm using that for a while now. now. You can probably tell that I've got a different setup here. Um, uh, I have I actually did buy that computer that I was complaining about for years, and uh, so it's kind of in the background here. I want to just try different things here. Let me know if it's not working out or not. I might do something else in the future. But uh, this is what I'm doing for now. So here it is without the plastic on it. And it's actually kind of, as you can see, it's got a metallic kind of glow to it. It's not, I don't think it actually is metallic, but maybe it's got a gloss to it. Hmm. It's fine too. No. I like it. And as Arrow usually does, it's the same image, but I'm going to reverse it once I open it up here. In fact, let's take a look at the... Um, Special features here. Let's look at this. It's not as shiny with this. Step aside, Pennywise. These killer clowns from outer space are pacing. Oh shit! Are packing popcorn guns. When Mike and girlfriend Debbie learn that a gang of extraterrestrial killer clowns have landed in the nearby area, the cops are naturally skeptical. Before long, however, reports are coming in from other locate. Loca oh shit! I can't speak today. Reports are coming in from other local residents detailing similar run-ins with the large shoed assailants. There could be, there can no longer be any doubt. The killer clowns from outer space are here, and they're out to turn the population into candy floss. Written and produced by the Chiodo brothers, that Chiodo? Chiodo brothers, known for their work on the likes of Team America: World Police and the Critters movies, the Killer Clowns from Outer Space is a cinematic experience unparalleled in this galaxy. And then a bunch of special features, special edition contents. That's not supposed to K there. Uh, brand new restoration, 4K. I don't know if, uh, how much transferred over. I, I, I would assume it's the same transfer, but I'm, maybe it's not. Because uh, maybe it was a 2K scan, this is a 4K scan. But uh, I, I don't know. But it's still cool. It's got lots of stuff on here. Uh, new remastered stereo 2.0 on 5.1 DTS. Uh, optional like stub pedals for the deaf and hard of hearing. That's archival audio commentary with Shutter Brothers. Let the show begin. And let me... All new interview with the original members of the American punk band, the Dickies. The Chiodos walk among us through adventures of Super Mario Film. The all new documentary highlighting the making of the Chiodo Brothers' childhood films. Killer collection of the Chiodo Brothers' early films, including Land of Terror, Beast from the Egg, and more. Bringing life to these things. A tour of their productions. Tales of Tobacco. An interview with star Grant Kramer. Debbie's Big Night. Interview with Suzanne. Suzanne Snyder, making of Killer Clowns. Interview with the Chiodo Brothers, visual effects, hmm. behind the scenes, additions, daily scenes, bloopers, and gravity trailer. Anniversary sleeve featuring original and newly commissioned uh, artwork from Sarah Deck. Is that what it says? Yeah. And this is from 19. Hold on, what's it say here? 19. Well, it's not telling me. Where is it? 1988. Cool. And it is 86 minutes long. It is PG-13. I did not realize it was PG-13. Huh. Yeah, 
it is a one disc, right? Yes. Whoa, get shit out of here. There is the reversible art. I'm gonna switch that right now. That colorful disc. Ah, shit. There we go. This is the original artwork that they had on the um the UK. Uh, actually, I think they had a steel book. This, yeah, that's what it was. It was a steel book. Oh shit! Killer clowns. It's crazy. Killer clowns, more space. I remember this image. Very cool. What do we got here? We got a booklet. With those little fuckers, huh? I remember that image too. Huh? We got uh, cast and crew. And it's got two or just one. Just one, uh, one essay, it looks like. Oh, huh, cool. It's a long essay. Circus. Bizarro. Killer Clowns. I don't know. Uh, lots of images. That's why it's so much. Yeah, lots of images. Look at that fucker. Huh. Yeah, lots and lots of images. And the transfer, production credits, and the special thanks. That's cool. This is just a little pamphlet. Michael Caine in Pulp. I want a poster. That's cool. That's just typical. But I didn't think of that nice. There's that uh, initial post uh, artwork, and then the new commission. Oh, actually, it's different. I think. Yeah. What that's their deck or signature there? So yeah, this is new artwork. Nah, shit. Well, you saw on the back. It's pretty cool. I'll put that up. That's it. I'm not supposed to show you. I'm looking forward to watching this again. It's been a long time since I saw it. Got that together. And slide up right there. Boom. So yeah, that's it. Pretty cool, guys. I think it's pretty cool. I actually bought this on Amazon for... And as, as, as of this um, video posting, I think it's still like $17. So... If you're interested in it, it's still, it's fairly cheap considering it's an arrow, but uh, I haven't checked in a while, but it's, it was 1770 something or whatever for a long time, so I'm guessing it still is, or maybe I'm totally wrong, so if, I'm, if it isn't, I'm sorry, but uh, it was for a very long time, so anyway, that's it guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you around. Let me know if you like this setup, I might do, like I said, I might do something different, this is just because I've got a computer now, I don't have the same amount of space as I did before, and uh, I might try to do something else in the future but um this is what i got for now so thank you for watching guys and i will see you around bye bye